We still talk. We still see each other once in a while. Um, we're still figuring it out. I don't know. We're still trying to figure out what I'm comfortable with, what he's comfortable with. After being apart for years, Rose Lenore just reunited with her father. She wasn't even a year old when her mother Bonnie was murdered. There was never really a moment where I found out what happened. I always just kind of knew what was happening. I actually don't have any memories with her, so anything I have of her is what I've found on the internet. After her mother's death, Rose was adopted by her half-sister and her husband. She grew up in a quiet L.A. neighborhood far away from the cameras that hounded her father for years. For this small band of dedicated warriors, they saved Rosie's daddy's life. I do have memories with him when I was a kid, and they're all positive. So I was looking forward to meeting him, but I was also nervous because I only knew what I had seen on TV of him. I think I would have felt very um, guilty and sad if I never got the chance to meet him. Rose spoke publicly for the first time with People Magazine. It's interesting, as Rose has gotten older, it's been important for her to figure out her own life herself and to really control the narrative of her life and not just Google about the case and read what other people write about her. And while Rose and Robert continue to build their relationship, Rose says they still haven't talked about the night her mother died. I have tried to stay away from discussing that with him, and he's been so respectful of that. Um, I just kind of told him that I'm not really there yet. I don't want to know the answers yet. I think what happened was horrible and so sad, but I, I don't choose a side because I, I don't know any better than anybody else does.